if you are traveling abroad always keep a universal charger it support multiple countries as you can see for USA and Australia pull the pin it can be straight or you can just like turn according to the switchboard so I will show you here is the switchboard so if you're traveling with this kind of charger it will fit nowhere in USA and Australia okay so you will stuck with no battery and power so you need this you put this and you switch on and see the light is on if you don't think that I'm saying right you can just take like, it and see the light is on and it will just go off as the battery day now as the system capacitor drains the total power it will just like go off so you need this kind of charging system so in this I bought it from Reliance Digital reconnect it cost me around one uh, 900 to 1000 rupees but it's worth it with a six month to one year warranty so you can put your normal charger also on this like see your charger works so if you want to charge your device with charger put your charger two pin three pin chargers they give you two USB option so it says maximum load 6 ampere 250 volt USB output 5 volt 2.1 ampere and I will take this cable out and this is USA and Australia for Europe you have to press it so Europe will come out like this so Europe plug is more like Asian plug uh, almost like same length but the thing is our plug this is very broad and somewhere in like some countries in Asia and Europe have like socket which is like little bit dented inside so this will not work so less broad so this is uh, Europe and then UK UK is like this a flat head kind of thing you can either use three pin or you can use two pin and you can just like pull it inside and this is how it works very simple design but will help your problem but help solve your problem actually if you're traveling abroad you definitely need like actually minimum one to two pieces i'm always carrying two pieces very important to carry while traveling